Today we're going to learn how to update the firmware on your Matrice 300 aircraft, sensor, remote controller, base station, and battery charging station. It's important to keep your firmware up to date because DJI will introduce new features, improve existing features, and address bugs that have been discovered. First, we're going to learn how to update the firmware of your Matrice using the DJI Pilot app. Before attempting to update the firmware, ensure all batteries are above 50%. When you're checking the controller, make sure you're looking at the controller's battery, not the WB-37 battery. The first step in this process is to turn on the controller in the aircraft and ensure they are late. Next, let's ensure that our DJI Enterprise Smart RC is connected to a Wi-Fi network. First, drag down the top toolbar, click on the gear icon, select the Wi-Fi logo, and choose your Wi-Fi network. After your controller is connected to Wi-Fi, a notification should appear if a new firmware update is available. Click on that notification and then select Update All. During the firmware update process, do not turn off the aircraft or remote and be patient as the aircraft may toggle on and off itself and may make noises during the update process. Once the firmware update is complete, the remote controller will give you a prompt that the firmware has been updated successfully. Now, let's learn how to update the firmware on our Matrice using the DJI Assistant software on our computer. First, download DJI Assistant for Matrice from DJI.com. Next, log into the software with your DJI account. Then, connect your Matrice 300 to your computer via the provided USB-C cable. Then, power on the drone and look for your Matrice on the connected devices list. Select your Matrice then select Firmware Update to populate the Firmware Update list. When you're ready, press Start Update to automatically begin the Firmware Update. Once the update is complete, the aircraft should automatically restart and you should be ready to fly. Up next, let's talk about updating our Matrice 300 accessories such as the DRTK2 Mobile Base Station, the BS60 Battery Charging Case, and the TB60 Batteries. One great thing about the Matrice 300 is you can now finally update multiple batteries at a time using the battery charging case. Just like the Matrice 300 aircraft, there are two ways to update the firmware. The first option is to connect the battery charging case and the DRTK2 mobile base station directly to the controller using the USB-C connection. Once they're connected and powered on, the aircraft should give you a prompt if a firmware update is available. Select that prompt to open up the health management system and begin the firmware update. The second option is to connect the battery charging case or the DRTK2 mobile base station directly to your PC using the USB-C cable, then opening up the DJI Assistant 2 software. If a firmware update is available, click that prompt to begin the firmware update just like you would do with the aircraft. So that's how to update the firmware on your Matrice 300. If you have any comments on this process or the Matrice 300 in general, email sales at DSLR Pros or leave us a comment right here. Thank you for tuning in and fly safe.